hi guys welcome to my youtube channel so today we are going to see how to create a neon background effect in after effects it's a simple step in we need only five effects to keep it done together and make it easy so let's go to the video now i mean i have added the my project file in the description link so just uh, go out how i do it in may, may you can easily understand what i did so just download it and use it guys so i open the panel already did so if you are not it uh, just create the uh, panel work file and then right click it here now new you can see new and need to add one more adjust layer if you can't we need to uh, apply the layer effect so you need a layer so just create the adjustment layer so and go to the effect and preset panel here you can see now type radio waves so this is a first step for your process so we need to drag it out here now you can see play this now you can may the wave will be moving from standard to a away so this is the first step i need to if you need the waves will be moving faster just expand just increase the speed by frequency will be 1.5 you need more uh, number of circles here just added it and you need to expand this size will be big how large we need to do these circles by adjusting this no need even uh, we'll put 5 and frequency will be work one will be okay i think now you know next step the second step will be you need to uh, change the color because it's our default color is blue so just need to add one more color so i go go to the effect and preset panel and type gradient ramp so this is the second step of your process and uh, just drag it out into your layer first resize now you can see the color will be uh, uh, white and upper will be dark so because of the starting color will be black and the end color will be white so that's why this here we need to change the linear ramp to radial ramp because of you need uh, create a uh, circle waves so just it now select the start ramp of location from the center and then end of the frame will be down somewhere outside or right side whatever which one you need it so let's change the color first first one you see, change the starting color will be a light uh, light color with whatever I mean I choose this this one and the end color will be dark make it dark cool I can change you can see the the color will be changed but you can change the color uh, by the way you can change this too so if you need to change this color into rose you can change this now you can change the color will be here you can see the changes changes of the color by the gradient ramp and the third uh, step will be a, a displacement um, displacement i mean turbulent displacement will be the third step and just drag it out into your layer turbulent with displacement it will be make a uh, uh, linear i mean a uh, smooth circle will be uneven shape because of the neon line it will be move wave like uh, you can make it little bit uh, look like they are crazy so that's why you can add this step and now uh, increase this amount by increase this amount of the turbulent displacement you can change the uh, uh, smoothness into wave like a uh, messy so i choose it the amount value will be 400 now i can and you can need a change the size if you need a small size or big size whatever you change this color here i choose it at um 150 i think so it will be okay too 150 and the composite will be will be 1.5 i think is good 
now it's okay now it change the high because of we need a quality will be i need it but if you uh, think uh, you have a better performance pc like a ram and a gpu if you want if you have it just try it because of it's make a time more time to render it so just uh whatever how much you can i mean your pc will be can make it it will be take it too much of time that's why i'm saying so just leave it now it need the fourth step what which one what we if you can see the waves will be moving from start to end but uh, it will be uh, just one circle you not need a smoothness you can see only roughness edges so i can add one more step for uh, smooth waving i mean linear whatever uh, what i say you need to create a uh easy in easy out uh, way way so you can add a echo will be the fourth step echo will be added it now now you can see the difference now uh, i off it and turn on if you need you can changes but you need to change first the value and the echo time second will be a minus 0.015 seconds and now number of echoes will be 30 you need to increase the uh, number of echoes because of you need more uh, vibrant linear this okay so starting intensity will be 0.35 and now decay delay mean means you can need delay because of you need a difference needed difference so 0 0.05 will be uh, okay i think so now you can see the difference you can make it a uh, glowing and a uh, light little bit uh, uh, dry uh, when edges will be a uh, dark and smooth uh, erasing so now turn off the echoes you can see the difference from you can see here the difference will be uh, before adding the echo before add the echo and after add the echo this will be the difference will be the echo adding so that's why i'm adding echo it will be make a more time to rendering i already told you you need a uh, better best uh, gpu and uh, processor so i need and the final step will be its uh, color will be so dump uh, i mean so uh, less you know need a bright head so i go to add one more the final step will be the glow I think you need a glow because of uh, you can attracting more vibranting by adding the glow. Just add the final step of the glow. Now you need to ch uh, change the uh, value will be 50 and radius will be need more radiance. You need to increase by changing defaulting by increase you can see whatever i am glow intensity will be 1.5 and it will be 100 i think radius will be 100 it's okay now you can see the difference turn off turn on you can change the you can see the difference also by uh, before adding the glow and after adding the glow you can see the glowing effect now you can play the video first from first to, to start so it's make a more timing so let's uh, i go i will speed up this spot so just it and now it's ready now i'll play it from start now you can see it it was oh, amazing look like so i hope you guys you like this tutorial so just like the button and just like the like button and give your comments in comment section and download the file i got the added in the description link so and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you guys have a nice day bye